Hello, this is Mama Pig's Kitchen. In this episode, I will be showing you how to bake catfish pepper soup. I have my catfish here. You can see, and when you get catfish, the first thing you do, you look at it, is draw it. So normally, I soak it in warm water. I use my salt to rub all around. Then after doing that, I use my knife and I scrape. I scrape like this. You can see the drawing slimy stuff. You know the fish is slimy because it's always in the water. It's a life cat fish. So I scrape like this. After doing that, I wash it all over again with warm water, sprinkle my salt again. I rinse. Then I come this way. I use this cup to measure six cup. Six cup of water of this cup. Then I put it on the stove. I have my crayfish here. I have my grounded pepper, one teaspoon. I have one teaspoon of uh, salt here. Then I have my onions. I'm going to be blending these onions. I have this here. I'm, I only need about four or five of that here. Then uh, this one, I'm going to be blending it too. It's already roasted. You, when you open it, you get this out. Then I have my dry bitter leaf. I'm going to be putting the bitter leaf in there to give it a little bitter taste. I have my this. I also have this here. So I'm going to blend my nutmeg, my this. This is not Urema, mind you. This is Urema. Some people add it. Like mo most of you, like when I have babies, or some people tell me, yeah, they like the aroma of this Urema. You put a pinch of it if you so wish. Then you blend all together. Add it to the fish immediately when you put the fish on fire. You know it doesn't take time to cook. It's not goat meat or all that meat stuff when you are doing those pepper soup. Because it's fish, as soon as you blend all this, you add it. Do not blend your bitter leaf. So add your seasoning, like maggi and salt and your grounded pepper and crayfish all together. That's all. If you are the one that likes Uriema, blend small Uriema to eat. You can use it to eat your white rice and everything. And I'm going to do it now and I will show you. Okay, I finished blending my ingredient. I mixed it, everything all together. So I'm adding my fish now. I gently add my fish. I'm going to let it boil. Let's see if 10 15 minutes will be enough. Then when it cook, I'll show you again. You like it thank you then I'm adding my bitter leaf now what I just do it I squeeze it in between my hand remember it's dry bitter leaf you can also use wet bitter leaf if you so wish I'm adding my dry bitter leaf I just scrub add it add all the fish then you stir that's all okay this is the end result I cooked my fish for like 20 minutes 15 to 20 minutes then uh, this is the end result please subscribe to our youtube channel and don't forget to share and like as well thank you very much just give it a try at home